Hey guys, Bricks and Mandalore here, back with another video. Today we're going to be looking at this Warsaw Uprising Lego Mark. So, for this one, it is just the Warsaw Uprising. This is the outskirts, they have taken over the city and uh, taken over the barracks and um, stolen loads of German weapons. So, like, I don't own any um, German armoured cars like troop transports, so I was going to use that, but if I had one, but I don't, so we're just going to have them on foot. Um, so these are the people of Warsaw coming to defend the city from incoming German soldiers. So this is a um, person here wearing just a normal jumper like a civilian, and but he's got MG. Um, 34 I think that is, not very good between the 34 and the 42, I know there's a difference, just not very good at telling the difference, uh, then we've got these guys all running in with um, car 98s I think they are, or Mausers, then there's this guy in a Stullhelm there, I feel like um, a lot of these guys should have like Polish flags on their arms but they didn't really have time. I've got this guy here, he's been shot by that guy coming through there. But he's pulled out his pistol and shooting him back. There's this sniper there with a white Stullhelm trying to take down these people running him with a car 98k. There is a guy here shooting um, at incoming German forces. And this guy here has been taken down by the machine gun. But little there's the guys back here now. There was a second guy coming in with a... Uh, another... Like, coming in with a machine gun, well not machine gun but you know what I mean. Then there's this lieutenant back here who is getting shot by uh, this guy here who's also about to throw a grenade in there and take down those troops. Uh, there is a car 98 k there and a dead officer who this was probably like his building, like his office or something. And then when they raided in they shot him and just left him there. And there's a table and chair. Um, the tree line is in like snow because this is Warsaw in Poland and um, if you didn't know much about Warsaw, uh, I think the the Soviets during this were watching and they they were expecting the Warsaw people of Warsaw were expecting the Soviets to come in and save them, but they didn't. They um, just what let it happen. And um, then the Soviets eventually came in to clear out the Germans. But most of the war people of Warsaw were dead because they had been shot. Um, uh, then there's another dead German here. Um, this wall is made of that um, sort of dark red colour. And it's like half built. Um, some of these figures, actually, I'm uh, just going to mention one thing. If you recognise any of these figures from another theme, uh, from Lego, um, identify them for me. Because I know what they're, where they're from. And um, if you are a good Lego fan, you might be able to identify them too. Or at least where the main parts of the figures came from. Give you a clue. If you name the figures, they are Harry Potter, Star Wars, and Fantastic Beasts. So try and give me the name. Um, that guy there is a custom one I've made. I've just got the hat, the helmet, the Stullhelm, the head, and the gun from another thing. But that is a Star Wars torso from... Um, Moloch Speeder, I just reversed his arms around so it sort of looked like he was wearing a scarf and that like path thing he had all over him, like the sludge from Corellia's like um sort of looks like snow, so I thought that looked good. These guys are coming in with a um Vokmat, I think, I think it is, and then there's this uh the swastika and the eagle on the helmets, uh, that eagle looking to the left, so not not American, obviously. Um, this guy here, uh, the sniper figure, he's a new figure I've not used before. 
He's got this um, face from Star Wars for the scout troopers. And he's wearing a white stulhun. Just a sort of a bit of camouflage for him. The trees and the bushes are all lining along here. And he's behind a small tree. So guys, if you have enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe for more. Turn on notifications to see every time I upload. We are getting close to 50 subscribers, so help me out. Come on, promote the channel to other people in the LEGO community. And um, if you've got anything to say about this mock, please leave it in the comments. Um, all feedback is allowed. Um, thanks for watching. Goodbye.